Welcome back, Electra Beast here. We're going to take a look at the Project Jarvis TV build and we've loaded up the Ares Wizard. So we scroll down to all builds, click on Project Jarvis, we're going to load it up and uh, see what we have. Okay, so this wizard is almost finished running. And we'll be loading up with Project Jarvis TV ASAP. Okay, so this is Project Jarvis. It's a very futuristic type of skin. Really nice font. So it kind of reminds me of a cross between um, the Iron Man and Tron in terms of just the imagery. Very futuristic. So along our first tab here, uh, let's have a quick look at what we've got. So we've got the Evolve tab here. Documentaries, concerts, etc. Got UK Turks, we all know what UK Turks was about. Just brilliant content, live TV, sports, movies, documentaries, everything that you're gonna be everything you're looking for you can always find in UK Turk. Uh, salt, stream all the sources. So uh, another brilliant one. Find everything you need in there. Uh, TVs, movies, everything you're looking for you're gonna find in there. Uh, Exodus, we all know Exodus is one of my favourites. Um, you'll find your TV, you'll find your movies. Um, you can link it to your IMDB account so you can add things really quickly. Um, you can stream in various different qualities, so HD, SD. Um, you've got a little tab here which will give you shortcuts to your favourite, almost popular and you know latest films. Within here. You can scroll down under Exodus and check out TV genres, what's most popular, search by actors, etc. Phoenix, we all know what Phoenix is about, it's just one of the best add-ons you're going to find in Kodi. You're going to find all your movies, uh, TV shows, live sports, etc. Then you've got the Goodfellas. Got sports. So you can see what's about there. Then you've got your add-ons tab. Let's have a quick look in the add-ons. See what we see what we find. Okay, so you've got Evolve, the Alpha, Bulldog Streams, Cosmic, which has recently been added to the Phoenix. There's some really good content in there. Tweaks. So I guess this is sort of like the maintenance tab where you can delete your thumbnails and clear your cache if you're ever having any buffering issues. Uh, reset everything to a fresh start. Check your download speeds. Programs built in. So you've got your Ares wizard, you've got your Felves wizard. You can use those to change your builds. If you go up, you've got maintenance, add-ons. And various other wizards. Maintenance tool features and things like that. So that's all really nice. So overall, it's quite a nice build. Um, I do find it a little bit confusing. There just seems to be a lot going on in terms of what you can see in the background, what you can see in the foreground. It all does blend in a little bit. Um, so while I like it for novelty value and I'd probably use it for sort of, you know, a week or so just to kind of scan around and see what's there, it probably wouldn't be one that I'd use permanently. But again, it's more just sort of a personal preference in terms of what I like in my builds. I quite like builds that are a lot more simple, sleek, um, things that just, you know, it looks nice and it pops, whereas this is just, it's just a bit much, it's a lot that's all over the screen, um, sometimes you're not quite sure where exactly you should be looking, um, 
But again, if you like that sort of thing, it's the kind of thing that if you sort of had friends over and they came over and had a look at your build, they'd actually probably be quite impressed by it. Um, and you know, maybe they'd want it for themselves. But just for me personally, it's not something I'm gonna use on a long-term basis. But um, I can see why others would like it. Um, it's got a massive amount of content in there. Don't, it doesn't seem to have sort of a live TV section which is always handy to have on your Kodi box. You always want to have, you know, live TV and things like that. Um, but obviously you can get live TV, you just need to look in certain places, I guess. Um, but again, you know, I'm sure there'll be people who've got a lot more experience using this particular build than I have. This is the first time I've loaded it up and, um, you know, I'm just having a quick look just to see what you get first glance um, anyone out there who's used this build extensively and knows any tricks or any secrets the way you can find bits of brilliant content put them in the comments below I'm sure there are loads of people who'd love to hear where you can get some hidden content and things like that and again just subscribe for more videos hit the like button hit the dislike button tell me what you love about this build tell me what you don't necessarily like so much about this build um, should I use the Jarvis Go build instead we'll have a look at that one at another date so for now I'm gonna sign out I'll be back with more videos in the future but for now peace <laughs>